This is Amorpha fruticosa, or indigo bush. This is one of my favorite plants because it's a native plant that fixes nitrogen. It's a shrub, and it's not spiny like some of the other native uh, nitrogen-fixing shrubs. Plants fix nitrogen through a symbiotic relationship with bacteria in their root nodules. So, there are bacteria in their roots that form nodules, and they exchange nitrogen in, for carbohydrates that the plant gives them. So if you cut down one of these plants, a lot of those roots will die off and release nitrogen into the soil that other plants may then access. So this plant, the indigo bush, is uh, very easy to cut down. And I cut this down actually in late June, and it is mid-August now, and it's already this tall. It's probably over four feet already. Yeah, it's grown over four feet in a month and a half. Most nitrogen fixers are legumes, so that's beans, peas, that family, and a lot of those plants have this kind of leaf structure. So nitrogen is one of the most important elements for a plant to grow. Um, nitrogen usually comes from animals pooping or green stuff decaying, um, and it's, it's a necessary element for plants. Oftentimes, you'll, that's why people add manure uh, to, their, to their gardens, one of the reasons. But so, when you cut this down, then I, can, uh, then I use all of this biomass as mulch around the garden. So then I'm uh, returning organic material to the soil and protecting the plants' roots. This also has pretty flowers in the spring. I usually wait until after it's done flowering, which is usually mid-June, and cut it down then. Because all, all the insects love this plant, love the flowers. So this is a nitrogen fixer, a native plant, and a beneficial insect attractor. It's also a mulch plant, a chop and drop plant.